What you doing down there? Back, 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 back. What is up everybody, it is your boy Jar, and welcome back to another vlog video. Man, yo, I'm pretty excited with this video. What's gonna happen is we're gonna install an exhaust for Sasha. So right now I'm just warming up Sasha. My buddies are coming here around 12-ish. What time is it? Oh, it's at 10, so I have two more hours. This is gonna be my first modification for for any car that I had. I mean, all the stuff that I did with my car before are mostly accessories. So this is gonna be like the first time I'm gonna be tinkering with, like, I mean, I would say right now with the exhaust system. I'm really excited because it's gonna change like how you are gonna listen to your car. They said it's gonna be loud, but it's not gonna be super loud. So I'm curious to see what's the, uh, the end product of this after the installation. So one of my buddies, they will bring some of their stuff so we can work with this car. We can use jack, but I think it'll be a lot easier for us to have a ramp and then jack it up at front. Well, I don't know, we'll see, man. Like I told you, this is gonna be my first time doing this. Even them, this is gonna be their first time. And there's nothing wrong going to like a floor shop to do your exhaust if you can't do it don't be ashamed of that oh well, i've seen like a lot of people especially on forums on group page yeah you're a car enthusiast should be working your car blah 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 but personally if you're not confident like tinkering with your car but as, as long as you know what you're gonna be putting into it you go to a reputable shop it should be okay i mean it is what it is some people doesn't have the tools some people doesn't really like to tinker because they're not really confident with it so i would say do what you can do and what makes you happy man so in my case i want to do it ourselves because this is like opportunity to learn right i want to know like how to install this even though like youtube uh shows you how to do it but it's really different when you're actually doing it when you're under the car and it's gonna give you a learning curve on whether what to do and what not to do so yeah and obviously it's gonna be fun because it's not just like installing it but also bonding with your buddies who are also excited to do stuff with a car right no matter what you do the only thing that you have to worry about is exhaust leak now the problem is here's the thing I don't know how exhaust leak sounds like so we're gonna learn that today if ever we have an exhaust leak I'll see you guys in a bit all right, here's Sasha. What I'm gonna do right now is I have some um, AEM airflow filter. So I'm gonna install that uh, in, a, in a little bit and a cabin filter. Those are like, I need to do it right now. So before my buddies come in, I gotta go ahead and do that. But before we actually install that, we have plenty of time right now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna unbox the exhaust and you know what here's the thing i didn't really open the box ever since i got it don't do that so i'm pretty <laughs> at the same time i'm really, i'm really scared because i don't know if if i get the right order if i didn't then i'm screwed so i'm gonna go ahead right now and check out the box and see if everything is in there everything is in place and it's ready to be installed hopefully there's no dents or anything like that and i hopefully i got the right one which is the quad tip burn tip exhaust a raised exhaust for a two-door civic si so we will see man <laughs> i don't know why i did it why you did that man okay let's go all right so here's the box um here are the cabin filters on uh, the dry flow air filter All right, so everything is in place. Everything is uh, right. So this is the, oh man, I'm so excited. 
So this is the quad tip, um, burnt tip exhaust from Emmy Performance. Um, I got all the tools there that uh, I need later, obviously. It's gonna be easy install. Um, got everything in here. But first we have to install this. And let's go. Damn, it's dirty. What the heck? Jesus Christ. All right, that is done. Man, look at that. That's dirty as hell, homie. Man, what I like about this um, EEM, it's a dry flow air filter. Basically, just clean it. I just have to buy the cleaning product for this one and pretty much dry it out. And once everything is dry, just have to put it back in. It's an easy maintenance. And hopefully, my throttle response is gonna be a lot better with this one because my, my, my car can breathe better and hopefully the rev hang kind of eliminates it hopefully I don't know ish what the fudge All done so I'm setting up everything took out the exhaust from the living room now it's here you need a WD-40 for later tools that I need for later as well and um, I saw some extensions as well right there so I'm gonna need those later they're gonna be here any minute now I um holy cow man I'm so excited boy Sexy Tori. We're just waiting for Kevin and all the tools are here. Uh, we're just gonna eat first. Need a little bit of energy before we start doing this. Should cross fingers should be an easy install. And hopefully we don't get any hiccups. <laughs> but yeah, we're ready. Let's see one more time, bruh. Sheesh. <laughs> Alright, we just ate, so we're gonna install this. Kevin is here. Sup, boy? <laughs> Let's go. We're trying to unbolt the uh, <laughs> the first bolt on the exhaust. I'm getting a hard time. It's really tight. Man, we use this. Um, doesn't work. But I think we just need more power. Did you get it? Power. Power, baby. That's the only thing that we have to unbolt and then everything else is supposed to slide it off because they just have the rubber bushing, whatever. I don't know what you call them, but... That to the rescue. <laughs> Come on, man. I almost called the muffler shop. <laughs> yeah, I think you just need more elbow grease. 
Oh. oh, there's the thing. Have you seen it? Yeah, right there. Right there. Bro, it broke. That's all good. I'm not a big deal. <laughs> oh, that's what I did <laughs> earlier. <laughs> yeah. What? Uh, I think it's snowing. Oh, boy. <laughs> that did the rescue. <laughs> So, holy cow. Alright, let me see. Let me show you guys. So, we didn't really tighten up yet, but we managed to put the clamps and everything. This one is holding the resonator. Now we just have to put the remaining part of the exhaust, which is going to be this part going to the tip. Uh, man, I'm so excited. And then we just have to check on the exhaust leaks. So, the hardest part earlier, okay, let me just move this. The hardest part earlier was taking out that clamp right there. Thank God my dad was here and he, he was able to help us. So, let me show you guys what the uh, tip looks like. So, this is what the tip looks like. Damn, look at that. Sexy boy. Alright, we'll just finish this up so we can start it up. All right, let's see. Let's go. So we check for the exhaust leak. I think we're pretty good. Uh, I don't hear anything unnecessary, but it sounds really deep, right? Like deep tone growl. Oh my god! I can't wait to like rub the shit out of this car. <laughs> <laughs> Once I get the tune, I'm gonna get a god tune, and this is gonna be like, blah. this is how the the. That, I'm gonna get a tune myself. <laughs> <laughs> so this is how my stock exhaust oh my god it's a one piece one piece exhaust man the hardest part right was this side right here okay we're we'll just clean up and then we're gonna we're gonna do some dry bikes can we yeah boy so the installation is done holy cow it looks so sexy <laughs> look at that I think we're just gonna do some drive bikes right now I'm just warming up the car and uh, hey what's up are you happy for me i'm happy for you oh boy yeah it, it's it's gurgling she thank you thank you put it up to six thousand six thousand yeah right, and, right, right. and then let it and let it down and let it out first gear yeah
so I'm so happy with that exhaust like yo it's worth your money for sure a hundred percent I'm ending the video now yeah that's pretty much all what we did today I uh, didn't manage to take a video of everything because we're really busy all of our hands were like all over the place thank you guys so much for watching peace